everyone welcome to or back again to andora sky so right now we're going to safari world and this is actually a sanctuary kind of thingy so like i don't know if it's a like wildlife reserve or what but uh, apparently this um where we're going right now it's where all the animals are there and probably birds and like um yeah basically a sanctuary what i said and so it it takes uh, the guide said it's going to take us around half an hour to go around the whole area so it's literally um i don't know it's supposed to be lost but let's see what do we have up ahead zebra okay um not my favorite animal but well what do you know these are um you see them every day on the road though don't you i mean like yeah but except that they don't have a um a body yes they're literally just flat lines no i'm talking about zebra stripes if you don't know but well okay there's a herd of zebras a lot of them there and um um marshlands i mean that's not marshlands but what do we have there oh we have camels okay yay um those are those are yes camels i want to know why they're not in a desert cuz how do they live in not desert areas and okay that i like that g the color is so cool and i wonder if those zebras think that they're like one of their own kind cuz what if they do think that way and some some zebra actually does weird shit with that jeep <laughs> okay this, this, let's not make this awkward i like those plants sticking up from the water the lake and holy shit are those birds yes okay look there are those birds perched on the branches of those plants coming up from the water and a zebra again so I, i don't know but the zebra it, it's like seems so pure and glossy i don't know it seemed like that i i just want to like i wish i could get down but yeah we're not supposed to get down we're only supposed to watch while the bus takes us around the place and as you can see there are other vehicles there as well and i i i also like um those are zebras yeah okay we have a lot of zebras around here i like those huts i mean those cone shaped shades but like why not plant trees where uh the sky the uh everything is just so perfect the weather's perfect the background the ace that the ace that is on point and we have camels again but not in a desert is that an ostrich Yo, I don't know if that's an ostrich. But uh yeah, I want to know well, what I was saying is um how how can ca- can camels live in places that are not desert areas? Like they they're adapted to the sand cuz they have like free eyelids for sandstorms and look at look, look at that bird posing. Yo, is it like uh, I hate it. I hate it. These birds know that they're being watched and they pose. No, those are rhinos. Yeah, a mama rhinos. Uh, I don't know if that was just that was just an assumption. Never mind. <laughs> and okay, so there are a lot of storks or birds. Okay, birds. I'll I'll, I'll go with I I don't know, man. I I don't know what these birds are called. I don't know if they're really storks or not. But let me just go with storks. Cause they look like storks, and they're not small. They're they're big enough to be called storks. And yeah, so what I was saying before is, why go with thatched, cone-shaped shades? Why not plant trees? Like those give more natural shade, and it's also better for the environment. Cause there are a lot of trees in the jungle. Okay, that is a vulture, though. That that was a that that was a vulture. But okay, yeah. So. It's hot outside anyways and thank God is that we're inside an AC bus. It has aircon obviously. I can't imagine being in the heat. I would be all fried up, dude. Uh. 
uh, that that would that would have made this journey horrible. But anyway, I, I like the the water. It's it's like a teal color. It's neither too blue nor too green. But uh, this side is green. And yeah, I guess it's probably because of the tree reflections. And okay, you see, there are a lot of birds here as well. I mean, why wouldn't it be? It's so comfortable. Might be. I don't know. It's probably comfortable sitting there and just chilling. And these birds, I can tell them they're having a good time. And the island is cute. That's like right in the middle of the lake. And there are a lot of lakes too. And I don't know. Okay, there are zebras again. Why do we have zebras? I mean, why do we have... Do we have only zebras? Are we gonna see only zebras? Do, I don't wanna see zebras. I've had enough of zebras. Can we like... Can we like see something new? What else is there to see? I wonder... I wonder what we're gonna see there. I'm. I don't know. I actually don't know what to expect. Cause I've. I've never. I've never been to something. Some a place like this before. Yeah. Cause I don't really go out much. I mean, we only go to one place every year. Our hometown, basically. But well, this is kind of nice. I could like watch this forever, but not. Not boring stuff and. Yeah, I know the video isn't like how it's supposed to be and that's because that's because it's really hard to film on a moving bus and like half of the time I don't know if I should oh okay giraffes well half of the time I don't know if I should like point to the left or the right because as you can see there are giraffes here and I have to keep an eye out on what's on the other side as well and I then I keep forgetting I keep digressing and I keep forgetting about what I was saying and blah blah blah. So I don't know if I should just shush, but I was saying yes. It's very hard to stand still and like keep the phone still. But well, okay, those giraffes are. I, I guess those giraffes hate the sun too, like me, because they're all in the shade. I want to see baby giraffes, but I don't think there are any baby giraffes here. And that zebra sh striped jeep is still there like why not have a jeep with um ochre color and brown polka dots to copy the giraffes because they're peaceful animals unless you mess with them because yeah i i read i i read that the giraffes kick can literally make a fly, make a lion fly facts people facts go you can check it up if you want so it's like really strong and it's legs and well what else do we have though we're only seeing can we like where's the cool stuff i want to see wolves and cheetahs and some action and not okay yo those birds seem really familiar with that um maho mohawk yeah mohawk and all oh that's that's rhinos yay fat rhinos <laughs> They're, 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 they're fat, but they're cute. Like me. <laughs> and we have storks again. I mean, yeah, there's so many of them storks and birds. And I guess it's only fair, because why not? There's, um, they have wings. They can fly. So they literally own the place, I think. And, but, but I'm tired of seeing storks. Can we see... When can we see the cool stuff and what cool stuff? And as I said before, I don't really know what to expect since I've never been somewhere like this before. But, well, let's just hope we see cool stuff. I mean, cool animals at least. But for now, we're stuck. I've, I've seen like there are a lot of lakes here. As, as you can see, we've passed by so many lakes and lakes. I know those are giraffes again and no babies either and, and it's fenced like you can't get out from <clears throat> sorry you can't get out from there I think that's kind of cool like aren't the animals supposed to be free you know look at the grasslands I, I made a poem on grasslands once when I went to this village outside like kind of on the outskirts of my town that was nice I, I, I like the hippos, uh, the, uh, why am I saying hippos? 
the rhinos. Okay, I always get co- confused between rhinos and hippos. Except that rhinos have horns. Okay, that I think was a one-horned... Maybe we're going into or maybe we've come from the one-horned rhino territory. Pause the video if you wanna check the uh, signboard. But like, uh, I, I don't know how much. Okay, what does it say? Bah, I don't know what to read that as. Because I'm kind of in a really inconvenient situation right now. So, okay, we can see deer. And what else? So, the, the, there's so many things on my mind right now. And I don't know what to say. So, okay, hi. There's this guy there. He's a friend. And he's a really good, nice person. Yep. So, um, uh, we see antlers. So, those are probably stags. We'll, there should be some... I think there was a uh, something written about bucks. But aren't black bucks? Yeah, but aren't black bucks like... Oh, that's... That's a really, really huge herd of deer, by the way. So, yeah, I think bucks are like male rabbits. But then... I think it also means uh, like male deer. But okay, whatever. But these are... Uh, what, what are those? Are those... Yo! Those are buffaloes! Who keeps buffaloes? That's so basic! Yo, I mean, why would you keep buffaloes? Those are so common. Like, see, that and that stag over there, if it's a stag. Like, that's okay, that is fine, but why would you keep a buffalo? Why would anyone want to see a buffalo? They're not exotic. They're not uncommon. Or or is it me? I see, it, like, buffaloes are so common for, common for me. Ugh. Why am I stuttering? It's kind of bad. Anyways, I think I, I guess we've moved from the buffaloes. Never mind. Screw them buffaloes. Um, not really though. <laughs> I I like how this this lake is surrounded by these tree branches, and but I but I don't know how the animals can drink water if there there are branches blocking the um bank, the shore, whatever it's called. But, well, maybe it's just for show. Because everyone loves to put up a show, apparently. Like, see how nice this is? See how nice we made it? The animals are so happy. Are they, though? I don't know. I don't know if they're happy. I don't know if they're sad. I wish I could talk to them, but as of now, I cannot. So, meh. Gotta wait till another lifetime. Who knows? And so this this lake is again surrounded by those cute little branches, and it yes, it does look cute like a lot. And okay, those storks are sitting there. I guess I wonder if um I'm I'm wondering yes I'm wondering and thinking about a lot of things right now. So maybe that lake is exclusively for the birds or storks. There was also a movie called Storks that apparently I never never actually watched because I forgot. And also, it was in my old PC that had to be rebooted because it stopped working. And I still don't know where it is. So, yeah, maybe that lake is only for the birds because you only see birds around here and there are no animals. Storks. Oh, I don't know what to say. That looks like a boat or, like, I don't know. It does it's kind, of, kind of fancy, if you ask me. Okay, so they're, like first on there th- those branch logs or whatever and there are like thin trees and those are deer again stags and antelopes i don't know if antelopes are there like i don't know the difference actually and someone tell me the difference between stags and antelopes but as far as i know they're of the same family probably i don't know i mean <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I, I don't know so much I don't know a lot about animals Nope, so don't judge me What what you can do is just um, Be with me On this ride And we're seeing some Not so interesting animals But let's hope That the future journey has something good for us And yo, okay look That was a tin roof Why would you have a tin roof? Aren't you uh, Unless you want to make the animals feel hot Because like Tin absorbs the heat And if you're inside Any tin roof shelter You you feel like really hot Because it absorbs all the heat And th- th- that, that's a horrible place That's a horrible choice for a shed but never mind. Oh, hey, that cab there. 
It's the color is cute. I like it. We have caps like that in our place too, but like not the same as that. But it's cute. The color. I like the color. And holy shit! Look at the birds. Are these called like what you would call thickets? And oh look, those are actually cute. I mean, those are like trees, but like dense. They're they're not too big, but they're dense. And those birds were cute. Oh, like what was that? Okay, that sign. I don't know what that sign read. I don't know what that one was either. Never mind. Let's just let's just continue, people. Continue and oh, that that mossy. That mossy lake. Ew. They should clean it. Well, it's dirty. What if it's poisonous? What if animals drink from that mossy lake? Oh, screw these trees. What if animals drink from there and like get poisoned and die? Anything could happen. You ought to clear that. Unless, yes, again, it's just for the show. Hey, wh what are those? Are those OMJ? Those are lions. Okay, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out! Those are actual lions! I mean, lions have manes. These don't have manes, so I'm guessing their lion is. Oh, MG, look at them just owning it! Those are Leos, people. I'm a Leo. Pride to Leos. Hashtag pride, hashtag family, hashtag love, hashtag majestic! Look at them! Wow, okay. I. I am. I, I do not have words to express this those look so cool is that an oh that's a lion that's the lion king the king of the jungle is sitting there i i don't know i could cry with happiness just just look at them not not caring about anything and just just on their way and that lioness is probably making its way and that lion is probably sitting with his wife they're like the lion is not only the king of the jungle, it's the king of the zodiac as well. And as a Leo, I could not be more happy with this. I mean, I'm, I'm, I've literally seen everything now. We could go back. I do not care. I've seen everything. I don't, I don't want to see anything. I don't care if we, uh, like, I was talking about seeing, uh, I don't know what. But wolves, cheetahs, I don't, I don't need to see any of them. Someone was tell, um, so this guy was telling me uh, that like um, lions are his family, but I was like, nah, fam, those are my family, cause I'm a Leo, I'm a proud Leo, <laughs> and like respect to all Leos out there. You're awesome, but not so much at the same time. I mean, yes, we all have our faults, but like, I cannot. I mean. Aren't you like a proud? I mean, you always would be so proud to see your animal, zodiac animal. And okay, we're into tiger, royal Bengal tiger territory now. And and yes, facts again, its roar can be heard heard from a, a kilometer away, or maybe three. I forgot, but yeah, something like that. But its roar is really powerful. I wonder if we'll get to hear them roar, but uh. I think we can hear much from all the closed windows and doors, but I, I still can't get over the fact that I saw real lions and lionesses actually with my own eyes. And just look at the irony, like they were so near yet so far, man. I wanted to go down and pet them, like literally pet them and take pictures, but I'd probably end up being their food, which would not be good for me. But uh, it would be good for me in a way that I, I, I would die. Yep, <laughs> my biggest dream would be fulfilled. <laughs> but, but other than that, yeah, never mind. I'm just happy I got to see the lions. And okay, now we're seeing tigers. I, I don't have any excitement now. I've seen, I've seen what could have, what could, was the best ever animal for me. Um, okay, let's see. What are these tigers doing? Oh, so they're like going to this lady. If you can see, there's a girl inside. I can't get it quite well on the camera because of the darn tree. But there's this girl inside feeding meat to the tigers. And they're hungry, I guess. Also, facts. Tigers need to eat a lot of food. Like meat consisting of around 
300 to 400 kilograms or I could be wrong do your do your research I can be asked to find out that much because making a video is hard enough okay it's just, oh, oh wow look at look at the tiger it has the audacity to climb up to that to the roof of the jeep and demand for food like poor girl she must already be feeling so scared with all the tigers around feeding them all what if what if someone decides to break into the cage and bite her hand and on top of that the stinking um smell of whatever meat she's feeding them and that those are those zebra cars again i'm gonna call them zebra okay zebra jeeps yeah zebra jeeps are better but anyways thank goddess i think we're moving on from the tiger territory i feel bad for that poor girl that she has to like and this must be her daily routine imagine going to tigers and i mean unless she has a good bond with the tigers i don't know she she maybe she takes it as just another daily job but if i were there i would like i would have given names i don't know if she did i would have given names to all the tigers and uh, befriended them and everyone would know me by my name and everyone would know themselves by their name every time i call out to them i'd be like come here jack come here um um okay i'm bad at naming them i mean not that oh is that oh look, look that tiger is literally chilling in what seems like a tub like a bathtub oh man these these animals are i don't know they kind of seem like they're living in luxury i don't know it seems so because you don't get you get your own personal bathtub in the jungle. And oh look, the jeep's there again. And I wonder how many jeeps are there. I think it's the same one actually. So <laughs> look at the tiger. <laughs> They're just like so greedy for food. And okay, that sound wasn't supposed to be there. But anyways, they're just so greedy for food. I mean, I don't blame them either. It's not like they're attacking zebras or anyone else. They're just they're chilling peacefully and then the tiger is eating meat. I've seen the tigers like um, gobble up food on TV. Oh, oh, we have a tiger fight. Yay. Okay, who's going to win? I'm on no one's side. But who's going to win? Look at the tigers. They're just, they just want to see the fight. They want to join in on the drama. But ugh, darn that tree. I can't see clearly. Oh, never mind. That fight. I don't know. I don't know how it ended. I don't know who won, who lost. But, well these were the tigers i mean i don't know if we're gonna see tigers up ahead as well because the zebras and camels and what um what other was um uh, i forgot giraffes yep those were those kept coming oh look at the bird it is so cute with its with its fluffy head but it also kind of looks like the arrogant bird that would peck on you if you try to touch it and no, oh, there's like bunches there are bunches and bunches of them and then nests too oh and this okay so this is i think stork territory and <laughs> they're like cute with their tiny little thin legs walking and i think that's where they have their homes or maybe they have their homes in those trees i don't know if they make nests and trees or like beside a lake or whatever but and, and look at that posing and what is that oh hippopotamus a hippo we, we're gonna see hippos where are hippos i like hippos hippos and rhinos yeah i confuse them except uh rhinos have horns hippos don't and hippos are in the water and i i think rhinos can't swim maybe but yes another fact um bullets don't go through rhino skin so there's actually a saying if someone says that you have rhino skin it means you're either so shameless or like so careless that you don't care about insults or whatever is thrown at you whatever shit people give you you have rhino skin so that means i mean it's it's so saying in my native language okay oh, that was a himalayan black bear so okay we're gonna see oh okay black oh that's emo I like emo. Black is so good. I mean, it looks good. I do not have a good experience with bears. Actually, I hate bears, but in a in a metaphorical way, not a literal way. I wasn't attacked by any bear or anything. Nope. It's just I don't um, I don't particularly like that word. Yeah. 
due to certain reasons but never mind those bees are actually nice yes they're carnivore i mean they're omnivores but that doesn't mean well they would necessarily eat people they don't eat dead people though another fact hashtag another fact for the day so i could like just pretend to be dead and <laughs> that 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 bear is chilling in the pool and that bear is chilling in that pool too it's so cute it looks so cute it's so cute it's so cute i i i, I um well oh that that that, that were the bears i guess the himalayan black bears and well i i don't know what else are we going to see i don't i don't know what else we're going to see but let's let's look into let's look what else is there and what are those are those i can't see yo oh, deer maybe i guess i can't see properly oh never mind never mind though uh the mossy the mossy pool again oh i don't know someone needs to clear that pond i mean the lake yep whatever it is i guess i guess we're like um i guess it's the end of our ride a safari world maybe that sign maybe says like thank you or visit again i don't know but yeah i think probably we're done so i, I just want to say that's it for the video people please do not forget to like share and subscribe obviously if you're new to my channel and it did this video took me a long time to make by the way but yes make a great day people and juices You do sometimes. Seeing